Hello everyone, hello YouTubers, all that sort of stuff. If you're seeing this, it could be on Davison.com, could be Kickstarter, could be anywhere. But this is the start of making a solar powered, solar powered baseball hat charger. In other words, that panel there will run enough juice to run LED lights mounted here. Or mounted here, this is a light bulb fake looking thing, which has been recharged by the solar panel and can stick anywhere, it comes with a hook, you can hang it, turns on and off, and it recharges from that, which is mini USB at the other end. So my idea is, and you can look at more at movementsensorlights.com, yes that's it, movementsensorlights.com, basically we're going to turn this baseball cap into a solar sun charger, I prefer to call them, because there's far less on search engines. So if you want us, search for sun chargers, LED, solar, Phuket, Thailand, something, Ian Hewitt, I Hewitt at Facebook. So Facebook.com, I for India, Hewitt. Hotel, Echo, Whiskey, India, Tango Tango, I Hewitt at the end of Facebook.com. You got it. Here we go. Good idea? Okay. Solar panel. Don't you love them? I decided to mount it on the back of the cap, like that. So we're gonna have to punch a hole through it here to run our cable for the, we'll call it, I suppose, the prototype. So we punch a hole there. we we'll make it a bit bigger there to get the USB thing through. And this is a 258 bar basketball cap, which is uh, $12 Australian. Cool, bucks Australian at the Tesco. And we bought two, one for Darren to wear, one for me to rip to pieces. And try and get through this baseball cap. They're tougher than they look. Good quality for 258 bar. Um, we got New York Rams, Cubs and all that. Now, of course, they would have paid the, uh, the licensing rights on them and not all that sort of thing. They wouldn't have just printed the Chicago Bulls on a cap or something, but not here. Um, yeah, it's Thailand known for its strict trade practices. My favourite is there's a, a chocolate confectionery called Kit Kat. And it's in a red packet and stripes like that. And everyone pretty much knows Kit Kats. Well, here it's called something like uh, something else. And they look exactly the same. I think it says Time Out or something like that. But it's, it's a Kit Kat. That's a bit ripped straight off. Oh, I love it. Here we go. Don't put it. Design a bag worth twelve hundred dollars, but not really two hundred bucks. But boy, I can't believe it. But here we go. And to put it on here, I arrow dieted the last one on. I arrow dieted onto a baseball cap, and it stuck on really well. The light, basically, that's an LED light that's more of red and black wire. That if we glue that on there, we've got a bright light. But this will run anything. But you can charge your phone, run a light. And that was my first invention, was a light hat. And when you're outside, of course, it's charging like crazy. And into the battery, which is sewn in along the side, into the electronics, which is on the other side, with a switch, which can all come out of these cheap outdoor solar lights. Um, when they're going, they open. Okay. See, when it, when it notices there's light, they'll stay on for 15 seconds. And if there's enough light, it'll go off. And these are ideal for indoor. But how to use them indoor? It's a sun charger. Well, you put them on a stand outside and you charge them in the sun. And you bring them in and use them, they last just as long. When it's run out, you charge them in the sun. That's why I like to call it the sun charger. And we've got a stand for it. So here we go. Um, I thought, I was thinking all night, what I really wanted was silicon. Basically, silicon sealer. And I was just going to smear the back with silicon sealer. And punch you guys couldn't get any silicon sealer. It has got a peel off job. And we've found that these peel off things never hold what they're supposed to, but they hold it long enough to glue it with something that will hold it. Either Aralgite, super glue, or this is a new Yuhu one from Germany. It raves on about stick anything to anything. What does it say? Here we go. The all purpose adhesive. Sticks anything new from Germany. So we're trying it out. So we're going to use a peel off 
most each other and we know where to get them related to them and I, I, I'm going to put them on everything. Um, okay, I think the best way is to put the glue, now it's clear, I thought it was going to be yellow, this clear new sticks anything there and it actually has pictures on the front of material and that's why I bought it, it actually has pictures of different types of material, you know, denim, this sort of material, this sort of material. And so I figured, well, that's the material on, and that's the solar panel. Now obviously when we're getting made in China, and um, through whatever, whoever, whoever decides, we'll double it up, maybe a little bit smoother than this, but you get the idea. And I'd say, much, I'd say in the end, it'll be half the size of that, because these seem quite adequate. This one here, the small, more, sorry, it'll be two-thirds the size of that. But they're adequate to run that light, which is adequate. So basically, it's one of these pull apart. You take the you take the solar part, but I've used a different solar part, a more a better one, into the battery through the electronics that come with these and the sensor. That uh, here it is. Here. I'm not sure if you can see that, but inside this is the basically that's the motherboard. So you've got the battery holder, a motherboard on one side a light and the solar charger. You just pull it all apart, if you're good enough, mount this on one side and that's got your movement detector and your button in case you don't want to keep blaming people or if there's any reason you want it on, off or on. And on the battery on one side, motherboard on the other side with your switch, solar panel on the back and whatever you want to run on the front. You could have a little fan, you could have a light obviously which is where it came from. Uh, but we've thought of lots of other things. You could have a, a real light. I'm thinking of siliconing that to the front. In other words, we put that on the front, and you now have a solar charged light at all times mounted on your baseball cap. Plus, when you pull it out of the light, let's, let's say it's pulled in one device, and it's powering this light. So we have it like that, and it's powering that when it needs it. Okay, we'd have it wrapped up. The cable wouldn't be too long, the cable, maybe that long. This one's too long. And we'll shorten that. And now you have a what's known as the idea cap. Uh -uh. And I wonder if that's where I got my idea. Uh, the idea cap, sorry, they've got to go that way. Then you charge it like that. And then when it's charged, and it goes into your iPhone, and it's charging that, you walk along with a idea light. And if you want to put it on, you can. And if you don't want to look like a dickhead in the daytime, you take it off. But it's bright pink anyway, so I doubt I'm going to be wearing one. Um, but I did want everyone to know that I thought of it, and um, we're going to charge everything. And let's face it, I'd buy one just to throw in the back of the car in case I need to stick it, my baseball cap out the window and charge the phone. Um, and people here um, turn into the walking dead if they haven't got a, a cell phone. Oh, you know, you have to have your cell phone and charge there. So, this is what we're going to call it. The baseball cap. Sun charger. Like it? I love it. Maybe you've got to do it here. And see the top of your head, the way I see it, is the ideal solar catcher panel. Anyway, just testing this, um, the solar, actually I'm testing this UV glue. Um, it seems very good so far. It does say on the packet with pictures um, it will stick to material. And I'm going to bed. It's 2:30 a.m. and I'm real excited about these. Um, so basically, they'll charge that, and that will charge, will run whatever, charge your phone, whatever it does. And as long as you've got juice into that, this will be stay charged. Um, I've got guys better at. Uh, at making stuff than me, and they'll put it together much better. But uh, the idea, and pumping them out of China, should be fun. Thanks for watching, I hope that works out. And when you see a solar baseball cap, it was invented here, 4th of November, 2018.